At a glance, this is a dairy farm like any other. Livestock grazing in a field. The mechanical sound of milking machines among rows of cows. And a barn cat lounging on a hot summer day, perhaps hoping for a little milk handout. The workforce? Well, that's where this farm is a little different. My name is Lemuel Grace. I'm incarcerated for selling drugs. My name is Otis Christian. I'm in for weapons possession. Lemuel and Otis, along with other prison workers, milk cows eight hours a day, seven days a week. And they welcome the opportunity. It takes you out, off, out of there and to another world. It's like, it's you somewhat like, it's a sense of freedom. And you told me like the cows is like our families, like we love them. So we, it's, a, it's a big relief just coming down here. I try to tune what's out there and come here, you know, work and, and you know, come down here, do your thing. And you don't have to worry about nobody being too hard on you, take care of the animals and then go back, seeing like what other things I can do as far as helping out the farm. First I was kind of scared of them, they big animals, but I got used to it. Cows to me is like dogs, so they act like dogs a little bit. They pet. As long as you respect the cow, they respect you. The program instructors believe this chance might just be the turning point in the lives of these men. It gives these workers a sense of responsibility outside of the traditional prison cell life. Just working with the guys every day, if I can actually get to one of them where you know, they understand, like you know, what it's like to uh, work the nine to five job, or just be able to. Uh, maybe wrap their heads around as far as like when they hit back the street, they could get a job. For Otis and Lemuel, they recognize their mistakes. They see this job as a means to a new beginning, a fresh start and promise of employment after prison. It prepares you like as far as waking up in the morning, you know you have something to do, you come down here, you make sure like it's a, it's a milk factory down here. Hopefully I can move down here and possibly work in there. You know what I mean? Yeah, I regret it because I got kids. I got three kids and I love them. You know, but like, um, I did what I did, I did, and I got to pay the consequences for it. So basically, I mean, this is giving me more learning skills, more work skills to go home out there and make money, whatever, illegal in a legal way, instead of going back to life of crime. 